Healthline says rattlesnake bites aren't the sort of thing you can just shake off, as the snakes produce a venom that can destroy tissue, cause severe internal hemorrhaging, and do some serious damage to a person's circulatory system. Ideally, victims should be treated within half an hour, and the timeline for organ failure and death is about a max of three days. Even with treatment, research shows that some can suffer strokes, kidney failure, and the partial loss of organs like intestines. That said, here's a bit of good news. The Los Angeles Times says that while the U.S. logs an average of 7,500 people bitten by rattlesnakes every year, only about five of those cases are deadly. But the side effects are getting more deadly as the years progress, so maybe not roll the dice on this one. When rattlesnakes bite, it turns out that they don't always release their venom, especially into humans. But here's a very important footnote. Rattlesnakes that have been decapitated can still bite for around an hour after they're killed.